Hi, I'm CJ Weston. I can't believe we're doing this video on Super Bowl Sunday. I hate the Super Bowl. I hate Sundays. I hate the Super Bowl too. And we just went out and we wanted Krispy Kreme donuts. Krispy Kreme was closed. Chick's Diner was closed. And one Dunkin' Donuts location was closed because of a bullshit football game. I don't care. She doesn't care. Who cares? We care. What we want tonight are donuts. And this is this is how CJ Weston eats eats munchkins. Note the bowl. Munchkins go in the bowl. Yeah, a bunch of them. Wait, what? Yeah, look. go in the bowl. Yeah, all the munchkins. Why go. can't you just eat them out of the box? The munchkins go in the bowl. Why do they go in the bowl? I'm gonna tell you why. Look, milk, whole whole milk, vitamin D from Manning's. Manning's was open on Super Bowl Sunday. Where are you? Thank you for that? not closing your business because of a football game. What are you doing? I'm pouring the milk into the bowl of munchkins. Oh my god, that's bizarre. It, it's not cereal. It's incredible. Oh my god, that's so weird. You have no idea. Look if you don't this. try it, look at that. Uh, check that out. Right there, munchkins. The, they're like sponges. That's so they're gross. absorbing the milk. That's so gross. They, they are, the munchkins are absorbing. Watch. Here, now here we go. You ready? Look, at, I'm gonna stick this one down and I'm gonna let it fill. That's so nasty. Right, you, you, you get it? That's so nasty. This is the only way to eat a donut. Look That's at so it. Nasty. Okay, here it is. And then now it's filling. It's absorbing. Okay, now we can bring this back up. <clears throat> and now this is how C.J. West needs a donut. Mm-hmm. I gotta chase it. Chase it? With what? I gotta get a separate glass of milk. Oh my god. Everyone's enthralled with this football game. Like, oh, we're watching god. the Super Bowl. Yeah, well, where are you? Like, I got 27 texted. Where are you watching the game? Where are you watching that? What game? Shut up. I hate you. Stop. I want a donut. So, we're eating donuts. We did a lot today. The Intuidate, um... Facebook page is up. So you guys could like Intuidate on Facebook, Intuidate Radio. You could also follow Intuidate Radio on Twitter and follow CJ Weston on Twitter. And of course, you could follow Medium and Medical Intuitive and dating expert Marissa Liza Pell. Dude, let me just say something. What are you going to say? I'm not an expert in anything. Bullshit. I'm not an expert in love, obviously. Oh my God. I'm not an expert in relationships. I'm an expert in what not to do. Dude, this is a boring web video. No, I don't think it is. I think it started out great. Well, we're not talking about anything. But we could start talking about stuff. We're talking about donuts and how much we hate the Super Bowl. Thanks for the fork. It, I you mean, talk it, to them yourself. Talk to the people on the Now she's phone. yelling at me because I didn't get her fork, but like she was looking at me like I had 70 heads when I was pouring shit into a bowl to dip, and now she's doing the same thing that I'm doing. She's following suit because well, it's why, so awesome. Why not? Because it's so awesome. Because, well, look, you, you said when I did it that I was nuts. You are. We're giving you dating advice on our show and on these webcasts. And let, 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 let's just put it this way. We don't follow our own advice all the time. Sometimes we do. But right now, we're, we're not. Because we wouldn't advise you guys to rage munchkins in a bowl of milk. When you're trying to be healthy. Mm-hmm. All you people are eating wings, pizza... Don't, uh, whatever, yeah. oh, guacamole, that. that's really not oh, real guacamole, yeah, guacamole, you bought it in the store. I brought nachos and guacamole, oh my god, what'd you bring? Uh, oh yeah, the potluck Super Bowl party. Uh, oh, that's, yeah, everybody brings something. Everybody brings some sort of bar food. Everyone becomes a bar food chef on Super Bowl <laughs> Sunday. Let's go to the Browns house every year for Super Bowl. Oh my god, what are you doing? We're going to the Browns annual Super Bowl party. Every 14 years. We're so bringing the blue cheese coated celery and the buffalo celery and... The right. buffalo celery. Yeah. I don't care anymore. It doesn't matter. Yeah. What matters is what's coming down the pike. We got a lot of excitement coming down the pike. Excitement that can't be caused with a glazed donut. Mm -hmm. Shit's about to get real on a two-a-date radio. We got some big things come Big. Huge. Well, don't think you're just going to tune in two weeks from now and understand what's going on. You got to mm -hmm. catch up. Go no, online. this is like, it's not like a radio show where you can just watch once. No, you have to watch it in or listen in, 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 in succession. It's like Lost. You yeah. can't miss an episode. 
hugs, hearts. Yeah, Smiles. It, it, cupids, arrows, rainbows, Emoji unicorns, icons. Emoji icons. So we've got Donna Drama. <clears throat> we've got her love life to do about Valentine's Day. What about our friend Riss? I'm not getting into that. You, you don't want to go there? Oh, I will if you want to go there. I have no problem going there. All right, you're obsessed with her. Let's just get that on the table. It's not an obsession. It's obsession. I wouldn't call it an obsession. I'm just interested. Right. So let's talk about what happened. So I'll recount it as factually no, this is as I her side of the story. She's recounting, and I'll let you know what's fact and, and embellishment and okay. fiction. Chris, one of my friends with the same name as me, She's a beautiful one, woman. I, I agree. I think she's great. She's awesome. Nice person. Lovely. He had an interest, which is normal. She's a beautiful girl. <clears throat> he told me to put the word out there and see if she was interested. Now, when I talked to her, I asked her if she'd be interested in going out to dinner with him. And she couldn't really give me an answer right away, but she decided to... She decided to, I said, you know, why don't you just give him your number and then you could decide if you're interested or not. You guys should talk, blah, blah, blah. They talked. They decided to make a dinner date. The decision was made. Went to dinner. Mm-hmm. Leading up to dinner, there was a lot of, a lot of, uh things that started to change. A lot of plans started to change. There was a lot what of... Plans? A lot of stuff. What are you talking about? I'll meet you there. Oh, I have something to do afterward. Oh, yeah. I only have a couple hours to spend. Um, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm pressed for time. I got to go here after the Should have known then. Should have known then. I did know, but I just well, let it play out anyway. I, I watched it for my own entertainment. I kind of, I had fun with it. They ate pork chops. <laughs> it's a great veal, shop. veal shanks. Yeah, a great. It was so shop. good at Nunzio in, yeah. in Collinswood. He treated her to a nice restaurant. He, he did the work, so he really did it up. Yeah. And afterwards... And she deserved it. And she she still deserves it. She deserves a second date. You've earned it. I sure have. Riss, let's go. Let's do it. And it just doesn't stop. I mean, he tried to it give her... It doesn't stop. He tried to give her a kiss after the date. And she just... She backed away and said, no. No. And he still doesn't no. get it. Like, still doesn't get it. No. I and get then, it. And then they walked into the sunset in opposite directions. Still to this day will not stop telling me to text her, to call her. He believes it's going to be turned around. We were texting her yesterday. It could be turned it's around. It's not going to be turned I've around. Seen not it turned around. And this not is the interested. thing. Here's the deal. When women are interested, they can't help themselves. There have been two prior relationships that I've been in. I think you're familiar with at least one of them. Where right. both of the women in those relationships were not interested, but I, I persisted. And then the, the, they, they became budding and blossoming. Neither of them worked of out years in the end. Long, Well, I don't know if I totally say that. They didn't work out. They, they were, were great long. relationships. Okay, but that doesn't always hold true. And they true. were long term. They didn't this doesn't hold true. They were long term relationships. Doesn't mean they weren't bad relationships. They were they just didn't work out in the end. She's not okay. interested. She's not she's no longer responding to your texts. <clears throat> That's fine. We were both texting her yesterday. I was texting her today. I mentioned your name. She didn't mention your name again. Ignored your name. Continue to text me. She and I'm not it. done texting her. That's the no. thing. It's this is this not is your relationship stop. expert. This is your relationship. Your relationship expert. expert pursues persistence, patience, pursuit. Stalking. That's that's C J Weston's motto: persistence, patience, pursuit. And in his mind, at this point, he knows that she might see this video. Riss, if you're watching, and let's let's this number is his two. Intention. Deuce, let's go. Come on. <clears throat> this is his intention. Riss, let I'm asking you on Underline a date. I'm asking you on a second a date. On the air. I'm Marissa's web video. This one's for you. This chocolate nugget or munchkin. <laughs> I'm dedicating this to you, Riss. Just one more fucking date. Let's do it. All you ladies out there know this is a losing battle. It's not gonna not gonna happen. I agree. Well then stop. Stop texting her. Stop thinking it's gonna no. happen. It's not gonna happen. I don't think it's gonna happen. I know it's not gonna happen. Well then what's your point? Is it for your entertainment? It's for my own entertainment, yes. She doesn't answer. 
How is that care. entertaining? It entertains me. For what? How? When we sat there and texted her last night and bombarded her and like almost harassed her, it was hilarious. I was laughing. You were too. It's after the point where I said, I was texting her. He didn't believe that I texted her and demanded to see my phone. I needed to see it, what she said. I'm not doing it anymore. Why? I'm not asking you to do anything anymore. You're slacking on these munchkins. We have the amateur hour over here on my left. You're better at eating munchkins than me. Amateur hour. Look at now all the sugars absorbed in the milk in this bowl. I'm just going to drink the bowl. And, and if Riss sees this video, how is she going to feel about your donut eating situation? Oh, Jesus Christ. There's, I mean, she's already not interested. She sees this donut shit going on. She's going to run for the hills like twice. Why don't we just put it out there that maybe somebody else who's interested in your donut eating habits? If anyone's like interested in a dude who just loves to crush donuts occasionally, um, and Nutribullet, so you go to the extreme. You go <laughs> no, to like I do go to the extreme. extreme. Yeah, yeah, Nutribullet. Yeah. Um, yeah, that could happen. But Riss, I'm up for a second if you are. We're not talking about Riss anymore. I want to talk about Riss. No, she she's off the table. She doesn't care. She's not interested. It's over. Done. No. So we're putting it out there now for you to date someone else that it's might not be over. interested. It's over. Riss, it's not over. <laughs> it's not over! All right, so where are we left at this point in Super Bowl Sunday? Where are we left with? What are we left with? What, what, what are we left with? I can tell you what's going on in the game. I'll just talk into Facebook and see what some asshole has to post about it. Oh, oh there's oh, Riss. Riss! Broncos, come on! Riss! Yeah! Woo! Awesome. Riss is posting. <laughs> I am done with this web video. I'm not going to spend five hours editing this over munchkins. This is a great video. Munchkins, right, we milk, gotta go. web, webs, intuitate radio, Saturday, 3 to 4. It's getting nuts getting crazy. You gotta catch up on your episodes. Watch the story. Watch the story unfold. We're following Watch Gina and Donna's love life and now Mike's like love flower. life. It's gonna blossom. I can't take it. I gotta go. I gotta go to bed. Munchkins. First I gotta ed edit this now. Munchkins. Hi, may Han. Hi, may Han. Hi, may Han. Goodbye. Goodbye.